In this video, we look at the different options for bringing data across to Xero. We also look at what you can import, how to prepare your data, and what format it needs to be in for a successful import. When you convert to Xero, you decide how much data you want to bring across. To get started, enter your opening balances from your previous accounting system as conversion balances in Xero. Make sure everything is up to date and correct in your previous system. Then run a trial balance report for the day before your conversion date to get the opening balances. The conversion date is usually the day you start using Xero and is the date of your opening account balances. We recommend that you enter the opening balances for the first month of a financial year or the month a tax period starts in Xero. Once you save, conversion balances will form the opening balances of your accounts. Conversion balances don't give you historical or comparative data. If you need to refer to past data in reports, you have some additional options to consider. The first option is to add comparative balances. These are older balances you can use to compare against newer balances in your reports. Add comparative balances for as many years as you need, starting with the most recent year end before your conversion date. Choose this option if you only need to compare current with past performance in reports. The second option is to convert all historical data to zero. This requires a large amount of data entry. How much you enter depends on how far back you want to go. The more transactions you import into zero, the longer the conversion takes and the more complex it becomes. Before you commit to this task, assess the need for historical data and check if you'll have access to your previous accounting system or exported information. If this is the way forward, we recommend you contact a Xero certified advisor or conversion partner to help you. Before you export data from your previous system, you need to know what data you can import into Xero. Make sure you can access the data exported from your previous system in a spreadsheet. This lets you copy the data into our templates ready to import. Most imports in Xero use a comma separated value format, or CSV for short. Now let's take a look at what you can import. First, you can import your own chart of accounts with or without balances. Or you can simply use Xero's default chart. Next, you can import your contacts, invoices and bills to keep records of your transactions with customers and suppliers. To maintain a fixed assets register, import your assets with their accumulated depreciation and book value. If you buy and sell products or services, import inventory items and opening balances in bulk, and track the quantity and value of goods on hand. If you don't track inventory, use inventory items to speed up your data entry when creating transactions in Xero. If you've signed up for a bank feed, there might be statement lines missing from your conversion date to the date the bank feed starts. You can import these statement lines yourself. Now that you know what data you can import into Xero, let's take a look at how to prepare the data for import. It's best practice to clean up data in your previous system before you export it. Consider the garbage in, garbage out principle. The quality and accuracy of your Xero data is only as good as the data you import. First, check the accuracy of your data. Look for common errors that always need correcting at year end and fix missing or duplicate transactions. Next, look for messy data. For example, unreconciled customer and supplier transactions with outstanding payments, or unreconciled statement lines. Match payments with outstanding invoices in your previous system and reconcile outstanding bank statement lines so you're confident with the bank's starting position. Once you've cleaned up your data, export it from your previous system, then import it into Xero using our CSV import templates. If your previous system doesn't export data in a CSV or other spreadsheet format, export in a text format. Then open the text file and save it to CSV format so you can proceed with the import. Check out Xero Central for more detailed information about converting text files and importing data into Xero.